Good morning. Welcome to Pastor John's Fireside Chat. It is Wednesday, May 6th, my grandson's birthday. Happy birthday, Micah. And it's good to be with you during this video chat. I'd like to share with you some words from Matthew chapter 8. When he came down from the mountainside, large crowds followed him. A man with leprosy came and knelt before him and said, Lord, if you are willing, you can make me clean. Jesus reached out his hand and touched the man. I am willing, he said, be clean. Immediately he was cured of his leprosy. Now, I've not been wearing these masks very often, but I decided to wear it today as an object lesson. I want to first of all thank Tammy and Candace Early for making uh, this mask for me. As I go to the hospital or as I go to the store, uh, it's nice to be reminded that someone cares enough to go out of their way and show me an act of kindness. But I also wore it because it looked kind of strange being shut away when I'm trying to talk to you. And I share with you Matthew chapter 8 because aren't you glad Jesus didn't social distance from us? Please don't misunderstand what I'm saying. I'm not saying don't wear masks, and I'm not saying don't uh, social distance. But I am saying Jesus was never afraid to reach out and touch people who were considered untouchable. He reached out and he touched the man with leprosy who was unclean in the eyes of society. In fact, according to uh, the cultural traditions, if you had leprosy, you had to go around yelling unclean, unclean, so that no one would get close to you and contaminate themselves. Jesus came into this world to embrace the untouchables, and he still does. He comes to us today through his word, through his body and blood in Holy Communion, through the waters of Holy Baptism, to touch people who have been made unclean by sin. Not only to touch us and to love us and to draw us close to his heart, but more importantly, to take our sin upon himself so that we can be set free forever. That is the Jesus who loves us. The one who continues to touch the untouchable and set people free by making them clean through the forgiveness of sins. And I pray that you will experience the touch of Jesus Christ in your life. Have a great day in our Lord Jesus.